Good morning, everybody. How are you guys doing today? Happy Tuesday. Almost Paris. I leave on Friday, so I have three days. I have to do so many things, run errands, pack, buy some new clothes because I literally have no more fall clothes. I threw all of them away. I donated them, so I'm starting fresh and new for Paris. So I'm doing that today. Me and my mom are going to Burlington Coat Factory because they got the sale. And my mom be coming back with a whole bunch of bags, designer bags, and shoes. I'm like, mm, so this is how people do it. Well, I feel like this is not how we do it. We usually go online for cute stuff like Fashion Nova and all those other fast fashion brands. But Burlington Coat Factory, let me find out that y'all are lit. So today I'm going to get some cute stuff. Uh, maybe a blazer I have to buy. Oh my god, you guys, sorry about my throat. I don't know what's going on. Last night I had the AC on, but it was at 67 degrees. I get hot at night and then I woke up like, ugh, what is happening? So I hope I'm okay. I'm not getting sick. I am fine. Let's go start this vlog. Shopping time. Look at all these clothes. Um, uh, Vicky, where do you think you're going? <laughs> Sorry. I just love bothering her. She's going on vacation too. Like we all about to be out of here. I love that for us. Traveling. Look at all the shoes. What should I wear to Paris? Oh, these are cute. Uggs. Slippers. This is really cute actually. Um, not my size though. Size 7. Ooh, it's giving. It's giving. Oh my god. Imagine I pull up to Paris like this in BB. I used to work in BB, you guys, in Queen Center Mall as a stylist. Throwback. I don't think there's any more BB stores, but. Alright, Burlington Coat Factory got all the shoes galore. Oh, these are cute. You tried them on already? Oh, those are cute. Mm -hmm. Let's see how it looks. Oh, oh these are slippers. Boot slippers. slippers. Boots. So I'm looking for oh, a blazer like this would be nice. Yeah, it's right away. It's waiting right. for you. Size four is my size two. Okay, I could try that Where one on. on. Oh, this is giving Paris too. Let me look. Oh, that's great. Yes. This. Uh -huh. Oh, what size is this one? Size 10. That's big. I could try it on though, let's see. Try it on all of them. Try it on for you guys. This is cute. <laughs> this is so cute. Let me put my big fatty somewhere. <laughs> That's gonna fall off. Let me see. <laughs> put it inside. <laughs> I'm gonna find the mirror. Look at it. Cute! I, I like this. So it's it's perfect for the winter time. Yeah. Okay. Why does it, why it look so big Cute. size large? I guess just the space. But it's really nice. I like it. It's giving a teddy bear. What? Okay, this is how the blazer looks. In a size 4. I think it's cute. The black blazer. This is cute. Yeah, that's pretty. Take that one. For Paris. Mm-hmm. Cute. Love it. Next, I have this blazer with the white lining on it. It's giving tea party, but I need something to match, like a bottom, a bottom skirt to match this. A black pants. Let's see. Maybe I'll hold on to this one. I don't know. I have this yellow blazer from DKNY. This is so cute. Another staple for Paris. I'm about to wear blazers all week, you guys. You guys are going to get tired of me. Alive? Cute. I could probably wear this with some denim pants, a cute crop top, with some cute heels. Okay guys, I made it to the city. I'm about to go to my uncle's studio to check out his art, so let's go. Glowing, got my chai latte. Ah, my uncle! This is beautiful. Can 
camera shy. Welcome to my studio. My name is Billy Jared Frank. I'm a multidisciplinary artist and mm -hmm. filmmaker. And this is the new work that I'm doing right now. It's called Indigo Entanglements. Ooh, and it's like exploring that. the transatlantic slave trade. Kind of draw from similar themes as my 2022 uh, Venice Biennale work, mm -hmm. Palincep's Tales Swan from Sea and Memories, which explore uh, the life of Guano, who was a major abolitionist in 18th century England. He was okay. kidnapped in Ghana, brought to Grenada as a slave, then brought to um, uh, England, where he became a major abolitionist. And, wow. and uh, wrote a book called Thoughts and Sentiments of the Evils of Slavery. And Ooh. this is a, uh, a still from the film. Oh, yes, the film that we saw over the summer, right? That yeah. you showcased? No, no, Wait. no, no it wasn't, uh, it didn't, it hasn't played anywhere else. Oh, okay. Yeah. Wow, this yeah. is amazing. Ah! This is also <laughs> a still yes, I film. love this. I remember this still. Incredible. And these are all works connected to the Biennale project, Indigo, and this is looking at the transatlantic slave trade. And you use like the indigo coloring so to kind of like pigments. resemble the yeah, theme. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, you guys, my uncle is so talented. <laughs> Because I don't really show my family on YouTube, so I keep that very personal, but for a select few, I show a face. <laughs> I get <it. laughs> mm -hmm. Love. And what is this? Oh, this is a piece of fabric from uh, West Africa. Oh, wow. That's amazing. Oh, and my gosh. And as you gosh. can see here in the paintings, I'm using uh, this type of indigo fabric. Mm -hmm. And these are uh, all from West Africa as well. Where a lot wow. of the slaves uh, who went to the Caribbean right. uh, and America came from. exhausting but fun day you guys I did a workout today at TMPL I did some cardio back and legs your girl has three more days until Paris so I have to get ready and be snatched okay I'm going to wipe off my face with some micellar water I have no makeup on but this is essential before I wash my face wash my go-to obsessed with this face wash the face is all clean your girl is about to take a shower relax and call it a night because I'm tired I have to wake up early this whole week. I will see you guys tomorrow for another great vlog. Love y'all. Is it true? You actually think of me as less than you. Less than